Hey Dressage Superstars, welcome to Dressage Master TV. My name is Natasha Alcock and I'm a Grand Prix Dressage rider from Australia. And this is my gorgeous mare, Gretchy. And we're here to help you with all things dressage. And um, we have a question from Amanda, who's a Dressage Mastery member, asking how can she keep um, her seat with stirrups? So she has a great seat, and I did a great, awesome video for you guys for my 100th episode, showing you how you can use no stirrups to improve your seat. But how can you ride and have a good seat with stirrups? <laughs> so, cool question. And I guess um, the first thing you've got to remember is the seat helps you to keep your, sorry, the seat, the stirrups help you to keep a supple ankle. So when you ride, drive a car, not that I know anything about cars, but I know, I've heard, and mechanics will tell you that you need shock absorbers in your car. So you don't feel every bounce and, and part of the road that the car goes on. The shock absorbers absorb that, so you as the passenger sitting in the seat don't feel bump, 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 bump. Now when we ride a horse, obviously all we feel is bump, 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 because the horse, as the horse moves, um, it throws us out into space and, um, yeah, just throws us out, doesn't it? <laughs> so we need our own shock absorber. And if you look at me, and I'm doing this, this is hugely exaggerated, but our ankle joint is our shock absorber. When I don't have stirrups, I don't have as much shock. Like I don't have my shock absorber. So the, sh the stirrups really, really help you. You'll find it hard to ride with stirrups um, if you're not using them correctly. Um, and if you've got, if you've got your legs kind of turned out like that, you're going to love riding without stirrups because it's harder to ride with stirrups like that. Um, the stirrup is there to help you to get your leg in that perfect dressage position with your toes parallel to the horse, um, and your heels down. Now, it's not heels down for fun. The reason we have heels down is because that's the way our leg naturally hangs when we have our body weight down through our seat and then all uh, the rest of our weight down through our ankles to take that shock absorber. So when we start to trot, you'll see my leg, because I'm a sitting trot, naturally bounces. And that's because I don't want, if I suddenly stiffen my leg, do you see, I now bounce with my feet. There's a gap between my saddle and I'm bouncing up there. But when I sit down and transfer that bounce, down through my ankle joint, then my body stops, hello, um, my body stops bouncing and my heels bounce instead. So that's what your aim to do is with stirrups, to get that nice shock absorber and to get that nice bounce out through your ankle. Good girl. Um, so it's not going through your body. So I trust that helps. If you guys need more help with your seat, remember Dressage Mastery is a program designed to step you through step by step how to ride dressage and how to conquer not only the horse training, but you as a rider getting your rider training so you can be the rider you need to be. So if you're interested in that, month one is only a dollar and it's free, like it's a dollar to join. You can cancel at any time. And in that month, we do over an hour worth of seat. Um, and rhythm on the horse, but most importantly, your seat. So if you're interested in learning more about your seat, check out Dressage Mastery. Have a great week, guys, and I'll see you next time. Bye.